Welcome to Pixel Hobbies. If you are new to my channel, a big welcome. Here you find RC reviews, upgrades and mods, and run videos related to RCs. Before we dive in, please hit the like and subscribe buttons as they will help greatly with the algorithm and the channel. Well, we made it through another crazy year. The good news is that even during the pandemic and economic slowdown, the RC manufacturers have been very busy with new releases in 2022. It was very challenging to choose this year's list as there were so many great contenders this year. Nonetheless, here's my list of top 5 RTR RC crores of 2023. My recommendations are based on what I think are the best platforms that can grow with you, and they have to be generally available, so no custom LCG rock crores are included in the list. Also, they have to offer best value for your money. And most importantly, they have to be fun to drive and own. Please note that the list of the RC crawlers are just my opinion and my recommendation. So remember to let me know in the comments what is the best RC crawlers to you and why. So let's get started with my number 5 recommendation. My number 5 pick for 2023 continues to be Traxxas TRX4 2021 Bronco. Last year, I had ranked Element Night Runner as a better option. For $430, it offered more value and scale options than the TRX4. Having tested both of them out extensively in 2022, TRX4 offers more general appeal, especially when it comes to pure performance. IFS and the smaller tires on the Night Runner requires more finesse. As much as I love my Element Night Runner, for 2023, I would recommend the Traxxas TRX4 2021 Bronco as my number 5 pick. It's built upon a proven TRX4 chassis that includes high clearance poro axles, remote operated T lock differentials, super effective high and low 2 speed transmission that actually makes a difference in speed, and aluminum GTS shocks that are very good. But Traxxas added innovation to this latest incarnation of TRX4. It offers very innovative and effective clipless body mounting system that removes the traditional body posts and body clips for a clean look. The 2021 Bronco, the body sits lower to the ground compared to say the Defender, lowering the center of gravity. The 12.8 inch extended wheelbase combined with the best in RTR class Canyon Trail tires, makes TRX4 2021 Bronco a performer with looks to back it up. Thus, it is one of my top choices in scale trail trucks, even at the $550 price tag. My number four pick is Axio SCX103 Base Camp. It was released in May of 2022, designed as an entry-level SCX10 platform, to give hobby enthusiasts a matched performance at just $390. It retains the best things of Axial SX103 platform while simplifying the leg luster transmission. The base camp is built on stiff steel C-channel chassis and offer poro axles, which deliver extended ground clearance. The optimized suspension includes all metal links and oil fill shocks that is fully rebuildable and tunable. The body style offers simple scale looks with a lighter weight construction that helps with CG. But the biggest change is the single speed transmission that features full ball bearings and all metal internal gears. The simplification helps this truck to deliver the performance you expect from a crawler and get a good bang for your money. My number three pick is Axial Capra for a steer. Prior to last year, lots of folks that I know that owns the Axial Capra convert their Capra from two-wheel steer to four-wheel steer for improved experience. They no longer have to go through the hassle of conversion. With the release of Axial Capra four-wheel steer, Axial has equipped this Capra model with four-wheel steer for enhanced maneuverability and performance. It comes as a trail buggy style without a body like the other trucks on the list. The lack of body really helps with the clearance. Additionally, it comes with the Curry F9 Poro axles, which give you wider stance and also much improved ground clearance. 
However, Axial falls short on few areas. The transmission includes an optional DIG setup that is disabled from the factory and requires an optional 4-channel radio and micro server to get DIG working. For the selling price of $550, it would have been nice for Axial to offer both a forest tier and DIG enabled for ultimate performance. My number two pick is Element Sendero Sport Edition. The biggest attraction to the Sport Edition has to be the $299 price tag, which puts this truck well below the price of the other entry trucks from different brands. Although it is designed for the entry-level enthusiast, Element built a whole new truck on their original Enduro Sendero with a new transmission, axles, body, tires, wheels, and radio making this a compelling budget option. After spending a few hours with the Element Sendero SC at my local testing ground, I came away very impressed with the point that it buy for the first place. The stock RTR trucks have very difficult time with the climb test. For example, a TRX4 Sport was able to clear line number 1 and line number 2, while Element Ecto cleared line number 3. However, line number four, the very steep climb, is another story. So far, there has been only one stock RTR truck that was able to clear line number four, and that was Traxxas TRX-6 until today. Line number four really tests everything about the truck, especially the weight distribution. With 54% front and 46% rear weight distribution with the battery, and 0% overdrive, I really didn't think it was possible. But Element Sendero SC did it in third try, much quicker than TRX 6. As a trail truck, you will be hard pressed to find a ready to run truck that has this level of performance for $299. As a crawler, I did see some areas that will require some immediate attention, the main one being the ESC, a lax throttle control and drag brake. But that's an easy fix with the Hobbywing 1080 ESC. If you want to spend a bit more money, then a brushless setup with Hobbywing Fusion Pro will be the way to go. In order to keep the price low, Element made sacrifices such as bushings, plastic links, plastic shocks, lack of overdrive gears. But overall, I am surprised with the amount of features and performance they were able to pack into the price, and you will be too. My number one overall pick for the top 5 RTR RC crawlers of 2023 is Element Ecto. I consider Ecto the best value-based performance-oriented RTR in the market as of today. There are other cheaper options out there such as Redcat Gen 8 or even Texas TRX 4 Sport, which are both quite good, but when it comes to overall value and performance, Ecto cannot be beat at $400. This is a great example of continued fine-tuning of the platform. The Enduro line has been around for a few years, and with each release, they continue to improve upon the previous releases. And Element RC really hit a home run with Ecto. Ecto is basically a gatekeeper, minus the heavy cage body, going with lighter and narrower body design, extended wheelbase, and turning arms as rear suspension. Out of the box, Ecto has 56-44 weight distribution with overweight of 2,232 grams or 4.92 pounds. I normally use 1,300 mAh 3S light bulb. With it, weight distribution changes to 58%, 42% with the overweight of 2,352 grams or 5.19 pounds. The changes all work towards a crawler that works really well out of the box and gets better with just few upgrades and months. Actually, I strongly feel that you won't go wrong with any of the top 5 RTR RC crawlers that were recommended as we start 2023. Hope you found the information useful and don't forget to let me know what you think in the comments. Please like and subscribe and hit the notification bell to be notified of future videos. Thanks for watching Pixel Hobbies.